the Big 3 Upgrade. What is that exactly, and what does it do for us car audio guys? Well, underneath every vehicle's hood, there are three main cables that both ground and power the vehicle's accessories from the alternator to the battery. Making these cables bigger obviously increases the power flow, and we car audio guys want as much power as we can get. So in this video, I'm going to show you where those cables are and how to upgrade them. You're going to need zero gauge cable, a screwdriver, a wrench, and something to cut the wire with. The first step is upgrading your battery terminals to something that has zero gauge in preferably because you're going to be upgrading it to a thicker cable. The easiest step is finding a place to ground your battery to your car's chassis. You're going to want to sand off the excess paint so it will be a straight metal to metal contact. So once you have your piece cut to length, you're going to want to attach a terminal at the end just the right size to fit the bolt that you're going to be screwing it into your chassis so it's a nice secure fit. Then you can go ahead and screw it back into your terminal nice and secure. Wait a minute, I hear bass. Hey, look who it is. It's a bass car. Hey, buddy. So once that's secure, you're going to want to go over to your car's chassis and securely fasten it directly to the metal. Just like that. So now that is one cable of the big three upgrade, completely finished. The next step is finding the ground for your engine block. You can find it anywhere across the engine, just as long as it's a safe, secure bolt that you can attach it to. Now that your engine block is securely grounded, you can go ahead and attach that to the same battery ground terminal as well. So now we have two of the big three upgrade completely finished, so we're going to switch sides and go over to the positive terminal and start to run over to the alternator. You're going to need to go underneath your car for this, so I suggest putting something on the ground. As you can see, I'm underneath my car and I ran the blue wire directly over to my alternator. So now I'm going to go up to the top and tighten it. Once you have your positive zero gauge attached to the alternator, safely run it on the firewall all the way over to a safe spot so you can get to the positive terminal of your battery. Now that everything's in a safe place, I can go ahead and plug this into the positive terminal of my zero gauge outlet. As you can see, we have all cables of the big three now upgraded. And the final step is adding your accessory stereo cable and make sure the off fuses and your car is off so you don't zonk any of your equipment out. At this point, now that everything is connected, if you have capacitors, you can go ahead and charge that right now. You're gonna take your resistor and run it in series with your power fuse until your system is charged. Wait for the light to go completely dim and then it is safe to replace your fuse. And that's the big three upgrade.